the equations of the reaction between acids and metals as follows. Acid plus metal always gives salt plus hydrogen. Magnesium, example here, plus hydrochloric acid. Now you know, because it's hydrochloric acid, you're going to get the chloride. So it's magnesium chloride plus hydrogen. And here is the equation. Mg, magnesium, plus hydrochloric acid, HCl, plus MgCl2, magnesium chloride, plus hydrogen. Now, I think we should look at a few examples. I want you to pause the video at this point. Please do. Don't no cheat. Pause. And I want you to put down what you think is formed when magnesium reacts with sulfuric acid, iron with hydrochloric acid, or lead with sulfuric acid. Ready? So pause the video at this point. Write down what you think. No cheating. Okay. I do trust you guys. The first one, magnesium plus sulfuric acid, is magnesium sulfate plus hydrogen. Iron plus hydrochloric acid is iron chloride plus hydrogen. Lead plus sulfuric acid is lead sulfate plus hydrogen. So there we got examples of acids and metals. How do you get on? I think you would have got three out of three on that because it's so easy, okay? So give yourself a bit of pat on the back. Now, next sort of reactions we have are acids plus metal oxides. And the general equation is this. Any acid plus any metal oxide will always give us a salt plus, and not hydrogen this time, but water. An example, copper oxide is our metal oxide, sulfuric acid is our acid, and that will give us copper sulfate. You know that because it's sulfuric acid plus water. Here's the equation, CuO, H2SO4, CuSO4, H2O. Yes, now, I know you've got that, and I know you're really, really sure, so I think you're ready for a few more examples. Let's have a look, shall we? Here we've got three more examples. Magnesium oxide plus hydrochloric acid, iron oxide plus sulfuric acid, lead oxide plus hydrochloric acid. Now, pause the video. Don't cheat. Pause it and have a go, please, filling in this side. Okay? See you in a moment. Right. Sure you got these absolutely right. Magnesium oxide plus hydrochloric acid. Because it's hydrochloric acid, you get the chloride, it's magnesium chloride plus water. Iron oxide plus sulfuric acid, of course it's sulfuric acid, you get the sulfate, iron sulfate plus water. And lastly, lead oxide plus hydrochloric acid, you should get lead chloride plus water. I am absolutely convinced you got three out of three there. Well done. Last example of reactions of salts, acids plus metal carbonates. Acid plus metal carbonate, you always get the salt being formed. Now this time you get carbon dioxide and water. Let's look at an example. Copper carbonate plus hydrochloric acid. You know what salt will be formed. Chloride, copper chloride. We're told we get carbon dioxide. We're told we get water. And here's the equation. CuCO3 plus 2HCl is CuCO2 plus CO2 plus H2O. But guess what? That's right. I uh, got you now. There are no examples for this one. We don't need to. So not going to waste any more time looking at examples. Phew.